As a content creator, you need stuff. You need background music. You need tools to help you with your search engine rankings. You need captions. You need all this stuff. I'm gonna give you my recommendations of the things you should be using, and we're starting right now. This is how it is. What is going on? My name is Nick from TuberTools.com. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn how to grow your channel, make videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Okay, so like I said, when this video first started, there's some stuff that you are going to need as a content creator and there's gotta be some options for you. So I'm gonna give you my list, the things that I personally recommend, the things that I personally use. There's nothing on this list that I don't use personally. So I'm gonna give you my recommendations on the things that you should be using when it comes to this stuff. The very first one on this list is TubeBuddy. TubeBuddy is a Chrome browser extension for content creators that will help you learn how to tag your videos, test your thumbnails so that you can make sure that the thumbnails that you're making are something that people are going to click on and it'll tell you which ones are better. It'll help you come up with video ideas. It'll help you organize your video ideas. It'll even help you identify certain phrases that you can rank your videos for that will be better than the phrases that you might be going for when you're trying to learn how to rank your videos in search. And what I mean when I say rank your videos in search is I mean basically when people search on YouTube for something that your videos come up under that result. But in addition to that, TubeBuddy has a bunch of other additional awesome features, but that is the growth and management tool that I personally use and I highly recommend TubeBuddy. I'll put a link to them down in the description. Next on this list is Morning Fame. Morning Fame is also going to help you rank your videos because in addition to actually taking you through a process that helps you rank your videos, it also trains you on the most important aspects of trying to rank your videos as well. So Morning Fame is awesome. If you want to deeply learn how to rank your videos in search, Morning Fame is awesome because through repetition of using the tool, you start to gain an understanding of how things work on YouTube, which is awesome. Next up is captioning for your videos. Now, when it comes to closed captioning, some people are like, oh, do I even need that? The answer to that is yes, because we all consume content in different ways at different times in different environments. Maybe those environments are where we can hear, or we can't hear. So because of that, you wanna make sure that your content is accessible to as many people as possible. The captions that you're reading right here are done by Rev, and I highly recommend them as well. Also, link down in the description. Next up is Keywords Everywhere. Keywords Everywhere is awesome because at a glance, they let you see a general interest for a specific phrase that you are considering making a video about. Next up, and this one's specifically for iPad or tablet users with a pencil input, but <laughs> this particular one is something that will actually help you doodle out your content plans. And it also has a bunch of other stuff in terms of like your keyword targets and things like that, but it's really, really awesome. I use this to plan my content as well, and I actually created it. So make sure that you check this out down in the description below. It's called padplanet.com. And that's P-L-A-N-I-T. For background music, Epidemic Sound is what you wanna use. I'll put a link to a review I made of Epidemic Sound right here so you can check that out. But Epidemic Sound is awesome. They have all types of different music and you can actually cut out certain parts of the song that you don't like and things like that. It's just incredible. Epidemic Sound is the place for music for your videos. Next up, you gotta make thumbnails, right? If you don't have Photoshop, which is the one that I really recommend, but if you don't have Photoshop, I recommend that you use Canva because Canva has some really, really good options in it in terms of templates and things like that. So if you you don't have design experience, Canva will help you make thumbnails that don't suck. If you are into live streaming, Streamlabs OBS is awesome. That's what we use to run our live show every single Saturday at 9 a.m. Eastern. I hope to see you there. But in addition to the actual software itself that will help you make awesome live streams, they also have like a website builder and stuff like that. Really, really cool stuff for live streamers and content creators in general at Streamlabs. Now, if you have an established channel and you're going on YouTube and people are digging your stuff and you're putting out videos and you're thinking to yourself, you know what, I could probably make some exclusive content that my viewers would really love, then you need to check out Uscreen. Because with Uscreen, one, it's kind of like your own YouTube or your own Netflix really, to where you can send people there and then they can pay a monthly fee. And within that monthly fee, they get access to all of the stuff that you put inside of it. It's awesome. Now, of course, you wanna make sure that you have the right type of content for that. But if you just check out their website, you'll quickly be able to identify if you do or not, or you'll just be able to contact them if you have any questions. Next up is tubertools.com. This is another one of my my projects with tubertools.com. We've got video graphics inside and a bunch of other really cool stuff for content creators. So tubertools.com, you can actually get stuff on the front to where you just get like one thing at a time, or we actually have a membership to where you can get everything plus more. 
Next up for social media automation and management, I recommend Agora Pulse. And the reason that this is cool is it actually lets you just schedule out stuff like crazy. So let's say that you put out a video today. Well, you can actually schedule that video to be posted on Twitter like every so often. You can say, okay, I'm gonna post this next week and then I'm gonna post it the following week and then three weeks from now. But you can schedule it all out to where you constantly have videos going out onto Twitter even if they're not the videos that you're making right now. So you can just go ahead and schedule everything out, which is pretty cool. In addition to that, they also have a really cool feature where instead of just putting the link out there on Twitter to where people can actually watch it on Twitter but not come onto YouTube for it, they actually have an option to where you can check a little box and it'll show your thumbnail image instead. So basically what happens there is they have to actually click that link and come onto YouTube and start their session on YouTube on your channel in your video, which is something that is really really good for you on YouTube. If you have tools that you recommend, please bring them to my attention and let me know down in the comments below. I have an entire playlist where you can actually see some of these tools in action and see how they work and find out more information about them right here. So you can go ahead and click that. And to learn more about growing your channel, making videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.